What's up everybody, Ricky Kruth here. Welcome back to my channel. So today's question is, will technology take your job? Let's get into it. What's up guys? Thanks for taking the time to watch today's video. Listen, there's a lot of chatter out there about AI and technology and Amazon and Google and Apple and all these different technology companies trying to do things to take our jobs, to make it to where people don't need us anymore <laughs> to do the work. And I think it's absolutely ridiculous. Technology is not taking our jobs away. Technology is only making our jobs easier. It's making it more lucrative. It's creating situations where you can do things 10 times and even 20 times faster than we used to do. We're able to communicate with Lord knows how many more people per minute, per hour, per day, per month, per year, per decade than we used to be able to. I know that in my industry, real estate, it used to take me 15 hours to look up and call 100 people. Nowadays, I can click a mouse a couple times and auto dial those 100 numbers and do the same damage within an hour and a half. I can literally do things 10 times faster. And I even had an agent that sold 100 properties in his very first year in my coaching program because of this. He took full advantage of the technology. He didn't make excuses and say the technology might take our jobs or that this and that, or he didn't make excuses. He used the technology and he just got to work. He didn't ask questions, he just took action. And that's what you need to do. You need to quit asking questions. You need to quit thinking about what ifs. And you just need to take action. Like I said in a previous video, 95% of the things that you worry about never happen. So quit worrying about technology taking over your job and just get to work and produce more. If you really think technology is gonna take over, you need to take full advantage right now while your job still exists. Now, if you're in the sales industry, real estate, car sales, whatever the case may be, let's talk about that for a second because in sales, okay, people want people. People want a conversation. They need a professional. They need somebody that knows the industry inside and out. There's too many variables going on. Okay, the, the salesperson is there to protect the consumer and that's what the consumer wants. They want protection. If they buy a house online, okay, sight unseen, or even if they go see the house, they don't know what they're looking at. There could be foundation problems. There could be, you know, there's no telling what's going on. They need someone on their side representing their best interest. That's why technology can't replace us. Voice to voice. I believe voice to voice sales is one of the most underrated sales strategies out there. And if you guys would stop trying to figure out how to go around the voice to voice and just hit it straight on and just commit and put the work in and talk to these people, get to know them, see what you can do to help them, build that brand forever with everyone you ever talk to, your business is gonna exponentially explode. So to answer the question, will technology take your job? My opinion, no, not in a million years. But even if it does, we can't worry about that right now. If we think it's gonna happen, we need to milk this situation for all it's worth right now. So stop watching YouTube, stop watching whatever platform this video is on right this second, push stop and get back to work. Let's go.